Oh my gosh, that is his daughter. And his son! We killed his son! Oh. Hey everybody, welcome back. I'm Kelsey and PGK, and today is the grand finale of killing 100 Sims to have the most haunted house. If you're new here, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on that notification bell so you are notified every time a new video goes up. I would really appreciate it. I killed this many Sims last episode, so we just have the remainder to go. So without further ado, let's just watch together. I think to begin here, we're going to adjust the death areas. Clearly the fire death area is not going to work. Goodbye rugs. And then we're gonna just stretch back out that pool so that there's absolutely no room to stand. We're gonna keep the cow plants as they are. They've been doing amazing sweeties. And then of course outside area, we've got them taking care of the graves and freezing outside. I would love to kick this man out of my house, but it looks like there's not really a simple way of doing that. Actually, I've decided we're going to replace the vampires with members of the Avengers. I can't kill Wanda Maximoff. I love her too dang much. But apparently we kept Caleb because I just in my heart know that I will someday get around to figuring out how to kill him. Also, Grim can stay because he's like the fun, quirky roommate that gets to watch all this go down. So let's teleport our boys into their little prison. Where are you gonna go, Tony Stark? At first I was thinking maybe he could work out to death, but I truly think a Murphy bed death is what I'm looking for. Joaquin, you go there. Bruce Banner is gonna die in the sauna. Clint would be good freezing to death in a pool alone. I'm still not over the fact that Clint should have gone. And then uh, we're gonna have Thor Odinson try to work out to death. It might take a lot longer because it is Thor. And then is this Natasha? Who is that? She's just a, a random townie. She too is going to swim to death. So I guess you're not alone, Clint. Ooh, there's another person. Add to family. Welcome to the family, Latasha, Eddie. You'll be in the starve to death area. Ooh, look at you. What? Taku! It's a little boy. I can't do a little boy. Mila though, welcome to the family. And I don't see anyone else around. So let's begin. Thor, get on the treadmill. Mila, you get on the machine there. Clint, are you flirting with her? Look at Clint's swimwear. It is just upsetting. Oh, <laughs> Tony Stark's already getting to know our lovely cow plant. Ooh, new person, new person. Are you in my family? <gasps> She is in my family. Ooh, who's this man? Bjorn Bergstein, welcome to the family. Dr. Raymond Chance, so many doctors around. Oh, hello there, Brent Tecky. Would you like to die today? We're putting Brent in with uh, Tony Stark. Oh my, look at that glitch. That was so spooky. Oh, it keeps happening. This place is defo haunted. Anyway, Tony Stark's on his phone. Clint's already freezing to death. Whoa, I did not expect Clint to go first, but I'm kind of okay with it. Maki is also freezing to death in the pool. Who's that? Oh, it's Bjorn. Bjorn looks real focused. I want you to focus on death. I mean, I'm sorry. Focus on swimming and freezing water. Let's see if there's anyone else. Aha, you thought you could evade me, sir. Well, welcome into the family. It's going to be a short stay. You know, we're also going to put you in the pool. Oh, he's a mermaid. I think we're still going to let him swim to death. No, don't you dare get to the side. Yeah, yeah, Bjorn. You thought that you had me there. You did not. How are you doing, Bruce Banner? Are you angry yet? He's just on his phone. Probably trying to text Natasha. Everyone's making friends with each other, which is so cute. But Tony, I think it's time for you to put some beds down. Oh no, Maki! I definitely didn't think Maki would be the first to die. Oh, and Clint. Oh, they both dying at once. That's 65 right there. Second Grim has arrived. Oh no, Tony! Is this it for Tony Stark? No, he gets to live another day. Oh no, Bjorn! 66! Oh no, Brett Hecking is freezing to death. Oh wow, that was sudden. I was I was expecting it to be a little slower. Oh no, poor Tony. He didn't even know Brett, but it would be pretty traumatizing to see a man freeze to death next to you. Oh no, Thor just peed his pants. Back on the treadmill, Thor. Ooh, another pool death. Oh, we're getting townies all the way from Batu now. Oh, sentiment was granted. I really value the time we spent together. I think it's made us closer than ever. Mila and Thor are getting to know each other real well. Oh no, is this the moment that Tony's gonna go? Oh, Tony gets to live to fight another day. He's too much of a tech guru to be killed by tech. That's 68. Dr. Peter, let's get you swimming. She's coming in. Dr. Raymond's coming over here. Meg, you can come. Oh yeah, let's get a whole swim team. Maybe Grim can come over here just for fun. We can see if he'll die. Okay, everyone, start swimming. Oh, she's too uncomfortable. Dang it, Meg, you're out of 
of the swim team. We're gonna make you starve to death. I guess Grim can go there too. Swim, buddy, swim! Just keep swimming, just keep swimming. Thor, I need you back on the treadmill. Looks like Grim randomly decided to hang out with Tony Stark. Oh, everybody's freezing to death in the pool. Grim, after hanging out a little bit with Tony Stark, telling him he's a fan, has decided to depart. But not our roommate, Grim, other Grim. Thor, you gotta work out, buddy. And Mila, you too. Oh, Gudri's here. Thor is literally debilitated, just like crouching down in front of the treadmill. Meanwhile, Meg is still fine. Oh no, Bruce Banner is dying of overheating at the sauna. Oh no. Joe Queen, I cannot believe outlived Bruce Banner, but here we are. I wonder if on his gravestone, it'll say like, that's the secret cap. I'm always hot in a sauna. Ooh, Latasha is also dying. Well, that's all three of our swimmers down. We're already at 82. Heck yes. It's surprising that there's these two random townies that have lasted longer than literal Avengers. Oh, oh no. Is this it for Tony? Again? He's fine. He's pretty indestructible. Even without the suit. Moved Meg into the sauna because she's just been having too good of a time. Oh my gosh. Makoa's here and he's hiding. Oh, now it's snowing. Let's change Grim's outfit. Maybe he would freeze to death if he was in a swimsuit. That's swimsuit's kind of upsetting, to be honest. Is that hair on his chest? Okay, we're gonna work out. Push those limits, Mila. Let's take a little tour, see if anyone's around. It's Kengo. Kengo, welcome to the family. Uh, Kyoshi, welcome to the family. I know you're both teens. Who's this? Lilith Vitor. No, Lilith! No more vampires. We'll just put him in their, uh, in their swimsuit. Still freeze in the snow. After careful consideration, I do think swimming in the pool might be a little faster, so we're gonna just have him do that. He's a vampire! You tricked us! Grim looks completely unfazed by the cold, so this new venture of mine is not going to work. And Thor Odinson has passed out on the ground. None of my cow plants are hungry yet. Putting those beds back up and down. Oh, who turned out the lights? Haunted. <laughs> Thor is being attacked by plasma bats. He is having such a rough time over here. Oh, Kiyoshi's freezing to death. But your vampire friend's fine. Tony's freezing to death too. Oh no, Tony. All right, Meg, you have been literally too chillin. I'm gonna have Meg do ghost duty and she's gonna make all of our new ghosts. All right, let's have her change her outfit to hot weather because she just needs to be freezing to death right here. Mila, she can't work out because there's no power, but she can punch. <gasps> Kyoshi. Oh, that's another one. Mm, what you say? Oh, that you only meant well. Oh, he can't do the beds because the tower is off. Let's change his outfit into swimwear. Oh, the lights are back on. Okay, he can put the beds up and down. We'll see which one gets him first. Oh, Thor passed out again. Oh my gosh, there's a simp swimming through my bed. <gasps> oh no, Tony Stark froze to death. The technology didn't get him in the end. All right, we'll have Thor carry on. All the ghosts have come to mourn Tony Stark's death. He wasn't feeling so good, Mr. Stark. Meg is finally dying. It took her so long. Here we go. Tony Stark right next to Bruce Banner. Rest in peace. Now we got 80. Oh, and Thor's very sad. I don't blame him. Are you crying? No. Grim is still fine. He just isn't having any fun. This is it fun for you, Grim? Grim out here shoveling snow. Why? Only 15 left. All right, Thor, you know the song and dance. It'll change him into a swimsuit. Joe Queen, I think I need you to freeze to death. We got one cow plant who's hungry. And then meanwhile, this vampire is still in here. So maybe we'll put him over here in our vampire pen. I'm gonna join Caleb over here. We'll get to you guys eventually. Thor's freezing to death. I'm sorry to do this to you, buddy. I do love you. You're one of my faves. Mila, I really need you to work out to death. I don't understand why you're still around. Thor got killed by the frost before I got killed by the bed. Oh, but it looks like someone can eat the cake. Mila, I've got a job for you. Mila, oh goodness. But the first one doesn't count. Okay, Mila, I'm so sorry. She's being devoured by my cow plant. Oh my gosh, she finished the snow pal. He's been keeping busy out here. Why don't you make more, buddy? You got this. Oh no. Okay, he doesn't got this. The only people still left are people who are vampires. Ooh, who are these? Okay, Holly Alto and Party House. All right, they're gonna change into the swimwear. Let's see if he can be killed by a cow plant. First cake is not death defying. It doesn't even give me the option. He can't do it. Oh, I totally missed that guy's death on the side. You win this time, Grim. I'm gonna have someone else eat the cake. Maybe the vampires can get eaten by him. Well, that's another one. All right, that's number one. We'll see if uh, he can get killed by the cow 
cow plant next. Who are you, sir? Add to family. It's Dominic Fraze. Oh no, we have 24 hours to pay our bills before our water shut off and the power shut off. Where we're going, we don't really need it. Holiday's freezing. Oh, she's also being attacked by bats, adding insult to injury at the end of her life. There she goes. Through wind and rain, the male woman will come. And unfortunately, you're coming home with me, buddy. Maybe you'll you'll pay our bills for us. How about that? That way, at least the Murphy beds work again. Taku, why are you out here? Where's your mom? Let's connect and try to see if we can add a family to my family because we're running low. We need some more peeps. Let's go for the Ghostbusters. We still haven't seen them yet in the show. And I know that was requested. Oh, those are some good Ghostbusters. Oh, it exceeds the maximum number of Sims. Ooh, let's add Kate McKinnon. I love. Kate McKinnon's character from the female Ghostbusters. Teleport over here and do some laps. Oh, we also got our male woman over here too. Who's this? Oh, it's Judith. She's a global superstar. That'll make our graveyard so popular. People will come from worldwide just to see Judith's grave. Judith too will die by frozen swimming. There she goes. That jump was so cute. Oh. He's frozen. That vampire needs to just go in here. Hang out with your vampire brother and we'll deal with you guys later. Grim, you can go in there too. I need you out of the way. Mele, welcome into the family. She's already pretty tense about the weather. I can't blame her. Oh, she took a big fall. She's gonna be on ghost duty. The undead pen, nothing's happening in it. They're all just chatting away. Who's that over here? It's Taku. Taku, go home, buddy. Don't look at the murder that's happening. Get through this storm. Save yourself. Oh, Taku. Oh my gosh. That scared the bejeebas out of me. But apparently the game wants me to watch Jillian die. No, back to Taku. I don't care about Jillian's death. I want to make sure Taku's okay. Oh, did he go? Taku's gone. He's left this neighborhood. It's for the best. Now, Kiido. Oh, he brought lots of money to the family. He looks kind of cute. Let's have you change your outfit into swimwear. Oh, nice, respectable shorts. Maybe it's a little boring to have everybody die from freezing to death. But hey, if it works, it works. Oh, he's mean? Okay, never mind. I take back that you're cute. Oh, let's see if he's got family that we can invite. Oh my gosh, Meg? Is Meg his spouse? <gasps> he's got a child. He keep just running out of people so quickly. <gasps> oh no, it's the kid. I don't know if that's his daughter or not, but she's out in the cold probably looking for him. Why don't we just uh, put aside my feelings for a second and add Winston to the family? No, he is, is freezing to death. I don't want to deal with any of this. <laughs> Lilith, what are you doing here again? Oh no, the little Little girl, I'm not gonna touch her. Winston, Serena, oh, he has a wife. Okay, he's got a wife. Why don't we invite his wife over? They'll be together forever, it's romantic. Oh, he just died. Oh my gosh, that is his daughter. And his son, we killed his son too. Feels bad, man, but he was mean and materialistic. This woman, oh yeah, Serena. Okay, we'll just have Serena, the wife, join the family. Daryl Charm, we're gonna have you change into your swimwear. Daryl is Crypt. Oh, they're getting hugged. Oh, but their hearts went down. This is not the awful. tragic romance that I expected it to be. <laughs> Welcome into the family, Duan. Why don't you teleport in with the cow plants and Grim? Always oh, feeling flirty. I have bad news for you. I don't think there's anyone here to flirt with. Always oh, a little lifeguard. He's gonna guard. No one's live here. Oh, right in front of his wife. She just walked away. Oh, and then she turned around like, oh, it's Grim. Ooh, here's some new peeps. Lilith again. Okay, Salim. Nice man bun. Okay, another one bites the dust. The wife is having some emotion right now, although she is kind of like, can I get out? Ooh, Black Widow achievement. Have a sim outlive five spouses. Wait a second. She must have been planning his death this whole time. I feel way less bad now. We've got our new member of the family getting warm under the covers here. No, no, sir. Gotta follow the rules of death house. Serena, there she goes. I just move away. I'm like, no, I want to put this man in a swimsuit first. I don't really want to watch you die. Ooh, there's two people walking around. Who's this? Malcolm Landgrab, Hofstadter Leonard. You thought you would escape us, Leonard. Another vampire and Lilith again. Okay, Malcolm Landgrab, we are gonna go into the death by workout area. Leonard's gonna go death by starvation. We've got a dress code here. Okay, that's another one down. Oh, Salim is dying. There's another ice cube. This guy wants in. Is this the Witcher? Who is this? They're having like a weird seance over there in the corner. Oh, another vampire? Wait, both of them are vampires? Oh, come on. How am I gonna get to the end of this if all I have are vampires? I'm gonna add them to the family. I think there's a way to make all of these vampires human again, and then I can just kill them all. Lilith, 
I know that you've been wondering if you can come in. You can come in too. Oh no, something's going on with the lights. There's only seven Sims left. And look at that. We have all of my lovely vampires. I am going to use the cheat code that turns you all not a cult. Boom, he's human again. <laughs> oh, I did it. And another human. There you go, Lilith. They all look so happy and playful. It's super weird. I know exactly where to put you all. Swim, my buddies, swim. Oh no, Lilith is already freezing to death. Wow, what a surprise. We would just need one more death in order to win. Oh, what? I thought Lilith was gonna die first. Here's one over here that we missed. We have the exact right amount of vampires to kill in order to hit 100. The light is dimming. Other Grim has arrived. Oh, look, my cow plant's hungry. Kengo is dying. I really thought I could get Grim killed by the cow plant. I guess I'd have to make him mortal. Oh, it looks like there's only one left. Caleb Vitor, the last man standing. I think that we need a more creative final death for him. And since my cow plants are hungry, what's the better way than to have him consumed by one? Oh, he fought his way back out. I love that Grim has not changed his happy-go-lucky demeanor. Boom, there he goes. 98, 99, 100, yeah! Oh, it looks beautiful. Just feels really good to accomplish something in only three episodes. <laughs> So next up, since we've reached our goal, I'm going to now make it a pretty haunted house. I don't feel like building the whole house myself, so I'm looking through the gallery using hashtag paranormal. Okay, this one looks great. The paranormal house. Thank you, Wafi, for making it. Okay, so here we are. This is my beautiful graveyard that I put next to it with 100 graves. I am very proud of it. I think it looks great. Oh wait, it's the Grim Reaper. It looks like the other Grim Reaper's still here. Grim lives in this house, you know, he's retired early and him and his other friend, Grim Reaper, are going to enjoy the most haunted house in The Sims 4 on Winterfest. Thank you guys so much for tuning in to this completely bizarre series. I hope you enjoyed it. If you would like to, make sure to leave a like on this video. Comment below if there's any other gaming challenges you wanna see me try. And until next time, I'll see you around the internet very soon. Bye.